Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This week I'm going to be using a new printable kit from my shop. So I've got a printable section that's gone up in the shop which has got some kits, some bullet journal kits, there's other things coming up there as well. But this is what it will look like when you print it out. It also comes with cut files so you can cut it through your machine or you can just cut it by hand. This kit is called Modern Mess but there's also like a rainbowy coloured kit which is all to do with self care. It's super fun and I was going to use that one but I may use that one next week. So once I've put all of the dates along the top I'm going in day by day. So I started with a half box which I flipped up onto its side as I spent pretty much the whole day just doing orders. So I was printing and cutting and then I went and posted them. I'm also sitting opposite a large window and it's really sunny outside but I'm wearing a necklace that keeps shining down onto my planner which I didn't even realise until I was editing so that's super annoying because it keeps making the camera want to focus somewhere else so all the flashes that you see that's just my necklace reflecting. I also completely missed last week's upload. Uh, there wasn't actually a reason for that I was just going through about five consecutive days thinking that it was Thursday. Every time somebody asked me what day it was, I was like, oh, it's Thursday. What's today? Oh, it's Thursday. And then when it actually got to Thursday, I like suddenly gone, oh my God, I missed last week's upload. Like I didn't even film. This is what happens when you don't use your planner every day. I lose track of what actual day it is. So I'm really sorry that I missed last week's upload. I am going to have two videos coming out this week though to make up for it. Obviously this is going to be my first video which is just a plan with me and then at the end of the week I'm going to be putting up another video. Anyway getting back to my spread. Um, so for the middle sections all the way through I'm putting down what my children will be doing for school and that kind of thing. i done this a couple of weeks ago and I really liked how it looked and how I was able to use it easier with everything being in the middle. And then for my bottom sections, they're just kind of things that I will be doing throughout the day. And then for the top section, I thought I would have one thing up there which would be either my goal for that day or just one job that I really want to do that day. My more exciting jobs are right at the top. <laughs> So for the projects that my children will be doing, so I have one that's finished college, well, is still at college technically, but will be finishing. So it's difficult for me to find or give her something that's going to keep her mind active and be something that she's into. They're not as young as just getting out the colouring box anymore. So I find it a little bit more tricky to find her and my middle son something. She is really into criminology though and psychology so I have been trying to find different things that she can research and get into that will keep her mind active, keep her happy. And then next week she will probably be learning more Greek mythology because she is really interested in that as well. However, my son is into technology, coding, gaming, that kind of thing and I have zero knowledge of any of that so I'm just going through a software that I know that he will be using when he goes to college in September so he has been learning how to use that software and the interface so he's a little bit more ahead when he actually gets to his new college so that's still really fun and interesting for him so it's keeping him occupied and for my youngest we have something called show my homework where his high school will post all of the homework that he has to do so it's more easier for my younger one because I can just look online and it's all set out and ready for him. The rainbow sticker that I'm just putting down to mark that we're going to be going for a long family walk comes with the kit as well as the large pencil sticker and the arrows as well comes with the kit. For Saturday obviously there's no school work and I've become addicted to a, a switch game called Stardew Valley so I'll be putting that on on Saturday and then we're just going to do some housework. I'll upload my second video on Saturday at 6pm. I didn't have a new release last week and I won't have a new release this week just because I'm in a bit of a rut with designing. I've hit a wall mentally I think. Every time I sit down to design nothing's really coming out how I want it to. Um, so I did put up the printable section in my shop last week and I might add something to it this week um, but if not I will be back to regular new releases very soon once I've got over this creative block. And then moving over to my sidebar I put a full box right at the top. 
I then put down two habit trackers and I split them up in the middle with another half box. One is to mark down about reading because I've been getting back into reading. Obviously I've got, had so much time and I have been ordering more books from Amazon. And then the other one is just to mark down for filming. And then for my to-do section, I've just written down a couple of things that I want to do throughout the week, hopefully every day. So practicing my different writing styles, drawing, painting, and then editing. At the bottom, I use some of my coffee and toast doodle stickers to mark down what we'll be doing for dinner. I'd done this as well a couple of weeks ago, right down at the bottom instead of doing washi, and I really liked how it looked and it actually helps me out throughout the week. I think I'm going to go back and use some of the Mambi skinny washi and just put a tiny strip of washi above it though, just so it splits it up. But that was it, I've still got lots of stickers left, probably enough to do another spread. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this week's video. I've gone old school and gone back to doing a close up, which I haven't done for probably a year because I'm so wobbly. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I hope wherever you are, you are safe and well, and I will speak to you all at the end of the week with another video. Bye guys.